Welcome to another lecture of iadubook.com, providing free lectures to students across the globe. Okay, and today we are going to take another question of US grade 6 level. This question is about whole numbers, right? So let's see the question. Write the following numbers in words. Very good. So you are given certain numbers, okay, and you have to express them in words. Right? So how do we do that? Let's see. Now when you get a number with two digits, right, if you remember in the place value table we have up to four digits, so let's take the place value table. Let's recall what we have in the place value. Right? So in the place value table if you take four digits, something like this, so you had the units digit here, you had the tens here, you had the hundreds here, and you had the thousands here. Right? So whenever you get these kinds of numbers, what you need to do is plug them in to this particular format, right? Starting from the right to the left. So you pick the rightmost number, which is eight, put it on the extreme right side, put the other number again here, right? So what do you have units place? You have eight, so you have eight ones, right? So you have eight ones means what? You have eight into one is equal to what? Eight, right? And you have nine tens, which means what? Nine times tens is equal to 90, right? So you have a number which is 90 plus 8, okay? And you just write it down as 90, 8, right? Similarly, we put in 907, we get something like this. What's the value of this number? The value of this number is, at units place you have 7, right? So 7 into 1 is equal to 7. How do you write 7? You write 7 like this. Here it is 0, so at tens place we don't have any value, right? At hundreds place you have 9, so you have 9 hundreds. How do you write this? You write 9 hundred okay do you have anything at tens place no what do you have at units place seven and seven simple you just read the relevant value apply it to the value in the place table move on to the next one when you write it down please note when we are trying to plug this into the place value table we take it to the right side. So we start from the rightmost number, put it in the right side. But when you are writing it in terms of words, you have to move from left. Right? The reason is, the ones as you move towards left, the value of respective digit keeps on increasing. Now the next one, 3, 5, okay, 3, 5, 4, 8, 4, 8. Right? Let's start reading it. Eight thousands. Eight thousand. Four. What is four? Four is hundred. Four. Hundred. Five tens. So how do you write five tens? We know that one ten is ten. Then you have twenty. You have thirty you have 40 and you have 50. 50 is what? 50 is nothing but 5 times 10, right? Or 5 tens. We have 5 tens over here, so we'll just write this as 50. Then you have 3 units. 3 units means what? 1, 2, 3. 3. Right? So 8,453. Right? Normally what we do is we put in an AND after 100, right? So let's say for example, 
we had 900 over here so we had said 907 right here you have 453 right so the procedure is simple just pick up the value add it to the column in which it lies eight thousands four hundreds five tens means what it's 50 okay we don't have anything called five tens in mathematics but this is known as 50 so we register it as 50 three units means three so 53 